Hi, this is Uwe Eichert, and I'm trying to do this video with everybody around me making me laugh and making it horrible. So anyway, I want to wish everyone a happy Thanksgiving, and I hope that you and your loved ones had a great weekend. We're in the final weekend of our Reality Shift Kickstarter campaign. Stop making me laugh. Stop making me laugh. We're very close to unlocking all of the stretch goals of the deluxe Kickstarter only edition of the game. And we've just recorded a playthrough of the base game and a second playthrough of the super track versions of the game. And this will give you a unique feel of the game mechanics and the puzzle solving of this incredible 3D racing game. So I hope you enjoy the videos and please share with your friends and <laughs> Quit making me laugh. <laughs> Have a great one. We have a new game of reality shift going on. We have Jim, Kirsten, and myself, Uva, the starting cube is here. You can start on any side because remember in reality shift physics have no boundaries. The magnetic cubes will hold your racers. Then only one side on the ending cube is a end point. So Kirsten begins by rolling her die. Yes, and I'm the yellow racer. So I rolled a five. Awesome. And so my first move, I am going to do a hmm. so Kirsten what? can do her actions in any order she wants she has to do a move with her die move then she can play a card and I'll materialize over there and I'll do my five uh, one two three four five and then I'll play my other five. <laughs> one two three four five and you always have to be pointing in the direction you are moving, going forward. All right, so Kirsten actually took all three of her actions. In your turn, you only have to play one action, which is your die roll. Now it's my turn. I'm going to roll. I have a two. Huh. She kind of screwed me over here. I can't go this way, but I could go this way. So I am going to play a shift card first. I'm going to shift this way i'm going to move my two starting on the side whoops oh come to think of it okay i'm gonna go one two unfortunately i only have another two card or three cards so i can't get to the finish line so my thing is if he runs jim would run into me or kiss and he gets destroyed so I'm going to stop there. I'm not going to go any further because I'm afraid Jim, if he has a good card, could crush one of us, move on top of us, and go for the finish. All right, so it's my turn. I'm going to roll my die to see how far I can move. I rolled a four. I'm going to start out by playing a white tilt card, and I'm going to take the finish line, and I'm going to tilt it up like this. I'm going to crush Uva here. Oh, I, I'm <laughs> destroyed, and I'm going to be out till my next turn when I'm going to respawn. And I'm actually going to start over on this side, and I'm going to move my one, two, three, four spaces, and I'm going to stop right there. All right, Kirsten, your turn. Can I have the die, please? Thank you. All right, I got a three, and... I'm going to, ooh. so I do not have any yellow cards, so I can't do anything there. Um, I could flip. Remember, the white Ooh. is the white is a wild, so yeah. any colored card can be used on that die, on that cube. Yes, I am just trying to think which one I want to do. Um. Now, for our Kickstarter supporters, the map board is going to be a mounted map board that comes with the Kickstarter edition of the game. It will not be in the normal distribution game. Also, you'll be getting additional cubes 
a fifth racer has already been unlocked. Mm -hmm. uh, we have so many neat things that add to this game. We're going to be doing a full uh, Super Track game next where you can see how crazy and fun it gets. In this game, you can be playing two, three, or four against each other, or with four people, two against two as a team. So what are you doing, Kirsten? I don't know. Okay, I guess I'm, I'm going to play this green card to turn it this way. And so I have three, so I'm going to go one, two, three, and I'll play my other three to go one, two, three onto the starting. So my problem is, is that the cards, end is on here, but luckily, which nobody knows, I have a 90 degree turn, and I am going to turn this, and I hope it works, 90 degrees, I'm going to respawn on the start move, and I'm going to move, one, two, three, for the win. Nice. Ta-da! So, the game, we kind of played it really quickly, and we're not playing it as evilly, evilly as we could have, because Kirsten, knowing that I was probably going to respond, could have maybe done this. Um, she may have wanted to have taken this after she moved up and maybe crushed Jim, so that I was even further from the respawn. There are many different ways to do it, or you can play nice. The average game is roughly 10 minutes, and next, if you want to see, we are going to play a super track game. Thanks for tuning in and thank you for your support.